Well, hello everyone. If you uh, if you stuck by, thank you. <laughs> Let's uh, hopefully hope 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 that worked because otherwise we are in a bad way. And I'm, yeah, <laughs> I need to figure it out. Oh no. Okay, it works. Yes. Okay. 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 So let's um. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's figure this out. So we are now going to need to make a fire and warm up for sure. Okay. Yeah. Let's get this warm. <laughs> Everyday normal in Germany. Okay, my ISP made an IP reset. Oh, that's annoying. <laughs> Good timing though. Yeah, you're right. Uh oh, that didn't work. Didn't like that one. Try again. Forty-five percent chance. Oh, what was I thinking? That didn't. Work. Come on, Come on, Astrid, get your get your stuff together. Okay. Stick. There we go. Oh no, I used my birch bark. No! <laughs> Come on. This one this one should do. And what I'll do is I'll make some teas up and get get a warm up bonus. Perfect. Then I'll make it make it to that trailer cuz I'm uh I'm tired and not good. Not good right now. Okay. Oh, I need to find food. Yeah, it's cold. Yikes. Um, I think I can throw some coal or coal in this fire. No, not yet. Might as well just make some teas here. Yeah, it's kind of weird glitch with the controller. It's like the one trigger didn't work as soon as I picked up the burnt burnt wheat with it. Just didn't like that. We got our like mini tea circle happening. <laughs> yeah, we're warming up here. Let's uh let's drink this. Just down to one little bit left. There we go. So we're gonna warm up from that. It's gonna help. Monkey stayed to his word, did not wait. Yeah, or or did he? Yeah, I don't know. Monkey said he wasn't going to wait if I was resetting. He's gone off to bigger and better things at this point, I think, which is just fine. No problem there. Okay, let's throw a piece of coal in here, and that way we'll get we'll get warmed up quickly, hopefully. A little quicker than we are. There we are. Three, three arrows up. That's good. We'll take it. So that tea's hot. That tea's hot. What else? What else is going on in our life here right now? We've got lots of food. We've got some band-aids. Oh, we can craft. Let's craft some more. There, oh, and our, our temperature is is climbing way up now, so we're at a good place. So let's uh, oh no, let's grab these and drink this one. Let's think about grabbing a torch here. That's a nice torch. Let's grab another one. And we're warm, so um, I think it's time to travel. Let's see if we can't find some birch saplings, eh? <laughs> Wouldn't that be nice? Oh, right out our front door. I hope this wasn't the secret birch saplings, because <laughs> it's a little too uh, 
two in my face. All right, come on, get it. Streamer's luck, yeah. I wasn't feeling so lucky there. There is no secret. There is always birch near this area somewhere. Okay, so it's a couple different ways, places where it can spawn, but either way, it's it's going to be around. So that's good to know, because that 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 comes into my like plan of getting getting saplings down on the ground, curing, and then uh, then forging, and then coming back to to a crafting session. Come on, we want all the sticks. All right, let's let's uh, take a peek around here. I think there's um, not much else going on, but I wouldn't mind finding a couple more birch barks. Did I pick up all my hides? Yes, <laughs> that would be funny if I had to go back down that rope again. Okay. Oh, there we go. Two more. Nice. Okay, let's uh let's get out of here. Let's go to Carter. And we'll have a torch in case there's a wolf, because often there is a wolf right there. Yeah, it's nothing exciting that way, let's go. actually get a nicer torch out and that way we'll come into the region fully prepared all right we are now moving on into mystery lake carter hydro dam Whew. and we know there's a wolf usually hanging around in this area so we're gonna try to make it pretty quick to the to the trailer get a good night's rest and then we have the pleasure of looting uh Looting Carter Hydro Dam tomorrow morning. There's always some good loot in there. Nice. Two bows and nine arrows in the making. Yeah. Good math. Yeah. The only thing holding me back is feathers. I think I have like three feathers. So I'm going to have to start thinking about that. So let's, uh, let's not even hesitate and just go right in here. Um, no, I want to bring these. I'll put them down on the ground. Oh, no. We'll use that to loot in here. I guess you'll find the feathers while um, they cure. Yeah, I just need to pay attention to corpse birds, because there's always like dead bodies and deer carcasses, and that's a good, easy way to get, um, get your feathers going. Cause it takes three feathers per arrow, so you need you need quite a few. Usually, I only can make a few arrows at the beginning when I first get my uh, bow. Uh, let's get some sleep then. Got my can opener, so might as well get this dog food before it gets too nasty. Okay, and also drink a tea, herbal tea, because I got lots of it and it's going to help me rest. Rest up and heal. Alright, sleep sleep time. <sighs> okay, drink some water. Yeah, and we got our health back up, so that's nice. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, right. You know what we need to do? <laughs> Flare gun. 
get that out and ready because we have it. I Might need as well, anything right? right now. Okay, let's go. There's a wolf will come at us now. I don't hear him. Usually you can hear like some footsteps and stuff, so let's just pop into this uh, trailer here and have a look. in here. Another book to burn. Okay. Go check out that truck. There might be something in there for us. Sometimes there's something in the back too of trucks, so it's always worth looking. All right, and now the loot bonanza that is Carter Hydro Dam. Yeah, always some good stuff to be at in here. So let's see what we got. Um, I might try to pull this deer hide off here uh, while, I, while I'm around. Let's see. Won't get too too dead. Let's let's do it. <sighs> gonna get a little cold. It's okay though. We're fine. I'm not gonna worry about the guts. Let's go inside. And I'll drop all my hides here, so this will be like a mini base for me. Yeah, thank you. Get that one kg yeah, one point five kgs of meat on him too. I will. I I just wanna get, get warmed up a little bit before looting. Oh, I'm gonna drop all the hides. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm doing. I'm gonna die if I don't warm up soon. I need something to eat. Just clean up our our little area here. Why not? Okay, well let's uh, have a look around. Oh no no no! I just want the papers. I don't want to harvest a bunch of metal. Get out of here. Nothing, nothing, nothing. It's fine. Won't let it deter us. Let's move on to the next room. Yeah, this could be boring, but I, I like it because you never know what you're going to get. Could be something good. Sometimes there's a hook on these workbenches and you can't quite see them. Oh, look at this. Boom. Lantern. Let's check this out. See what kind of shape it's in. 53%. Wow. Let's repair that. And then I can refuel it too, because I have some fuel. Why are you saying it's boring? Looting is never boring. Well, it's boring when you're not finding anything. <laughs> but I'm glad you're having fun. I, I do like looting. It's, uh, it's just probably boring to watch, because you're just... 
not not a whole lot of action you know no wolves chasing me down right now there's no drama i'm just just looking through drawers but yeah this is the, this is fun for me because i'm safe and uh i might get some get some new clothing or a hat maybe or something you never know There's a lot of water in uh, Carter Hydra Dam too, so definitely going to be okay for water. Make her way through, just systematically looting, looting this whole place out. And then we're going to boogie down to uh, camp office area. I wouldn't mind checking out Trapper's cabin because I found a Mackinac jacket at Trapper's last time and the Mackinac jacket is the best jacket in Interloper other than the craft craftable ones. So. I know that other room isn't done. I'm just going to pop up here and take a look. Okay, little little loot yet, but we're doing okay. Found a lamp, so or the lantern. So we're kind of you know, we're we got all the good stuff that we need. No fire striker yet, but that's okay. No bedroll, but that's in our near future. But yeah, I have read, read tips where people said don't don't bother looking and things, but no, you got to do it because. There's a chance, there's a slim chance, but there is a chance to get some random random loot. Alright, these are the good lockers, if I remember correctly. I got a lot of stuff in here one time. Oh, I spoke too soon. Oof, that hurts, team. Oh well, I can't win them all. I've been I've been pretty spoiled so far, so this game's sound effects are priceless for me. Yeah, they're pretty funny. Like the pry bar sound, or I really like the like when when you're sharpening things. Uh, that's pretty cool. gonna take us all day probably to loot this loot this place and I'm, I'm almost into the late afternoon already it just sucks at night because you can't see anything so hoping to do it before it got dark third player pair of fleece mittens I found. You can find Mackinaws and ear wraps in dam lockers, so it's definitely worth it. Yeah, I found a ear wrap in the safe ones too, so I'm definitely gonna gonna look. Um, checking it all, it's worth it. Tukes, coffee, for instance, in random desks, really. I've never found a coffee, but I have found a toque before, so yeah, it's it's worth it. So don't listen to those naysayers. Like maybe if you're in a really big rush, but otherwise just keep keep looting. Just have fun with it. But thanks, Adarm. Yeah, that's uh, that's good to know that you can find find all that nice stuff, and I'm not just <laughs> not just wasting time. Okay, what else we got? Let's go this way. I, think I did this already. So I'll make my way back down. 
If you are at a place, loot it. Sometimes you should prioritize moving compared to checking low loot buildings. Yeah. Like, this is a good like location for loot, so I'm checking it. But if it wasn't, then I wouldn't be here. Because I have got really lucky at Carter before. All right, let's let's make sure we keep on looking through this room. What's that? Oh, I thought we could pry bar. It's just nothing. some food in our belly. I like to keep my condition up high, so kind of kind of do the starvation thing, but kind of not at the same time. More food, good. It's another day worth of uh, eating. but I don't need any more books, so simple tools. This stuff will come in uh, handy. I have the quality tools, yeah, so I'm not going to worry about the simple tools. But I might as well just put them, put them on the shelf here, how about... Okay, let's get into the safe. I'm excited about this safe. Slow and steady. Come on. Okay, that's one. Just bring the tools to the door, why not? Yeah, maybe. I have a pair on me though, so and I know they're here. But yeah, I could probably organize all the good loot and just leave it at the main entrance. Just so it's centrally located. Wow, it's like 55 and 2. Do tools regenerate? I'm pretty sure you can repair the tools. So you can like repair the quality tools with the simple tools. A book? Ooh. Wow. Thanks for that book. Yeah, so um, you can use you can use the tools to indefinitely repair your tools. <laughs> oh, that's a shame. I'm choked. What's this shooting guy? I don't. I don't need that book. I can live there forever. Okay. Guess yeah. We need to go downstairs. But yeah, the tools do gen degenerate, but you can repair them, so no worries there. This is the one I put on the shelf. This one here, I just added. That's the one I added to the shelf. So I'll go take that and let's let's run this over here, and we'll have it. Oh, it sounds ugly out. Oh, it sounds really stormy. Yeah, so that's there now. We know where it lives. Can be its place in so case I need it. 
So hungry. Okay, let's carry on. Down the stairs we go. Time's it. Yeah, we got a couple hours of daylight left, so that's my goal for the rest of the stream is get this place looted up and um, get established for the next big adventure. Tomorrow morning I'm going to be starting my stream really early, so like 7 o'clock um, Pacific Standard Time a.m., and I'll get a good uh, good chunk of gaming in tomorrow morning. <laughs> so if you're having fun, try to try to check me out tomorrow. But if not, that's fine too. Uh, yeah, and you can always watch my uh, past streams. I'm I've got them on on my channel, so they're there in case you miss something exciting. <laughs> I've got. Uh, yeah, let's see, what else is in here? Um, I don't know if there's much going on in here. I think I'll just go down to the to the next stairs. Come on, get over it. Yeah, I'm also gonna, because what happens with Twitch is the videos get deleted after a certain amount of time, so I'm gonna try to upload them like to YouTube, and then that way, that way there's, if I do anything exciting, <laughs> the world will remember me. All right. Ooh, nice sewing kit. Oh, oh, wow. Loop Bonanza, wood matches, sewing kit, and stay on target, which is a good one. I like that book. I read that book because archery is one of those skills that is really vital to gameplay. So take your time and read uh, read the archery books if you can. But that was nice. That was, you know, we're in match, match heaven. We've got so many matches. And uh, yeah, let's just let's just have a quick peek at all our all our good stuff. We're on day day nine. Day seven. Okay, we're on day seven, and we've got uh, lots of matches. Plenty of matches. We've got the uh, heavy hammer. We've got the hacksaw. We've got the maglins. We're just doing. We're just doing great. We're very proud of ourselves, as you can see. Off to a good start here. It's it's uh, my run to lose. So, okay, let's open these up. Yeah, and this is near the exit to uh, Winding River, I believe, in in this room here. Yeah, so this is this is the Winding River exit if we wanted to go in there, but we don't, not right now. There is a chance for Bedwell down there, so say if we strike out at the Mystery Lake, we can always backtrack. But for now, I'm I'm content. We're almost we're almost done looting this place out. Perfect. Granola bar, why not? We drink almost anything about now. This is a huge, huge area though. There's so much to see in this uh this dam. I'm just hoping to get it all done by by the end of daylight. Hmm. How am I for cloth? Do I have any cloth on me? Five cloth, but only seven to eight items so far. Yeah, um, I think I I was spoiled because I came through here one time and I got like two toques, um, I got the head wrap, and I got another good article of clothing. And I was like, wow, the dam is the best. Um, these this scarf is always here, so that's a permanent thing I think, and it's better than the one I've got. So let's put that on. You got decent stuff, just not much clothing. Yeah, I don't have anything crafted, and I've got like the 
kind of crappy clothing but like these are the not not great <laughs> but i've got two pairs of underwear and one pair of wool socks boots i haven't found any good boots yet um and the jeans so i definitely can i'll see a lot of uh a lot of warmth bonus when i when i get my crafted gear going so that's why i'm trying to move <laughs> move quickly make the rounds find all the good stuff but i think i might make an effort to go to trappers um, just in case there is a, a jacket there or something for me, which would be cool. Oh, another set of tools. <laughs> So plenty of tools to be found here. Likely get at one to two jackets in Muskeg if nowhere else in the way. There's jackets in Muskeg, really? I've never found anything in Forlorn Muskeg, <laughs> um, but I've not explored it too well. Like. I know where that homestead is with the forge, but I've never found any any loot anywhere in Muskeg. But if I can find a jacket, that'd be sweet. Give me a bit of leeway. Sounds stormy out. So the train car is about 50-50. Oh, right, there is sometimes something in the train car for some kind of jacket, be it vest, light shell, or windbreaker. Okay, good to know. Forge, there's often a jacket of some kind and also a safe. Oh, okay, cool. So I guess the safes gives you an opportunity to spawn a nice nice bit of loot, but sometimes I just get a book, so I'm just like, uh, can't be, can't be too excited about safes because often, often there's nothing, but... That's good to know. I appreciate that, Sidearm. Thanks for letting me <laughs> let me know. All this is good information for me. Uh, and Forlorn Muskeg isn't a region I'm really familiar with, so that's going to be an adventure. We're coming up to the end of the dam here. Carter Dam is worse saved. Often nothing good. Muskeg will at least have like jeans and food at worst. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Um, Trappers, I got a Mackinac once, and Carter Hydro Dam, I got the head wrap once. So definitely option the option for good stuff but not always because i just got a book this time couldn't be bothered what's this oh i thought that was something on there for me nope Ooh, another pot take it i got two now so I can do plenty of water. I'm still traumatized by that run where I didn't have a pot for the first like 40 days or something ridiculous. Um, okay, we're done. We're good. Let's uh, yeah, let's uh make our way back out of here. Maybe do some repairs and pass some time. Make up a game plan. I can always drop a bunch of stuff off here and plan to come back here and do do some crafting stuff later. It's either here or trappers or camp office. So, and later if you found a stack of them, yeah. Take the meat from the entrance deer. You already checked, so it will decay soon. Oh, right, good point. So once I once I open up a deer, then it's a certain amount of time before it's going to despawn, and I won't be able to use use all that meat so I'll go do that I might always um, build a snow shelter actually if I'm doing that let's get some more cloth because I sometimes build a snow shelter in this area but I don't I think that's kind of a waste of time right now but I do want some more cloth just because I like cloth I want to do some repairs and I think these give you five cloth so yeah three good use of my time
inside our TV is unless I'm fighting Cam Fear, eh? That's interesting to know because one huge part of my gameplay in Interloper is hanging out in snow shelters. <laughs> Pass some time. But that's the old me, so the new me isn't doing that anymore. The new me is only going to use snow shelters for for like useful things like passing cap fever. But before what I'd do is I'd set up in a region like the first time I came through Carter, I killed a moose and I literally waited here until that moose hide was cured. And then I made that moose satchel and then carried on. They are for emergencies only. Okay. Well, good to know. I'll just keep a... Uh... What's this here? I'll just keep the uh, the cloth on me just in case. I'll try to have five five cloth and 15 sticks at least at all times and then that way. If I get in a pinch, I can always always craft up a shelter. I think I need to go up one more place still. I haven't gone upstairs here yet. Yeah, but now that I'm seven days in, the cabin fever risk mechanic is going to start, start coming in, into effect. So I think for the first seven days of interloper, you don't have to worry about cabin fever. But after that, you have to worry about cabin fever. <laughs> but I've been traveling a little bit, so I think I should be okay. Chance of bed roll, am I? If I'm right. Chance of bed roll. Where, Mister Colin? Up here, really? No. Maybe. Let's look. I've never found a bedroll up here. I didn't know that was an option. No chance in... is in Winding River. Uh -huh. It's in the camp office. Okay. So, Colin, it can be in the Winding River, but um, for my particular loot table, it's not. It's in the camp office. But we gotta be careful, because some people don't like the loot table. Loot table business. Me though, I need I need all the help I can get. Yeah, no shame. Like I'll use a map once in a while if I'm if I'm like really desperate, or if I'm like say I'm not playing but I'm like trying to look at look at other maps and see see if I can get more knowledge. And when I first started, like the loot table was mandatory for me. Now I'm not as worried, especially like this time around. I started. And I knew like <laughs> where everything was that I wanted because I I started Pleasant Valley and the all the good loot was right there for me. Cloth where? Oh, I guess I could tear up that. Yeah, it's getting dark. Yeah, I'm just gonna let's make tracks. It's gonna be dark in here. I might have to bring a torch into the into the mix. Ah, uh, yeah. But look, look what we got. Let there be light. Boom. Okay. Now I gotta get down. So let's let's get out of here. I'll make my way to the trailer. I'm not that tired, but that's all right. I think I have more than enough cloth to last me, so I'm not gonna. I'm not going to worry too much about collecting more. Yeah, don't mind me, I'm just eating my pizza. Let's put this light out and go through here in the dark. Save, save our fuel. Yeah, it sounds ugly outside, so that's okay. All right, let's think about dropping dropping some stuff off in here because this is a place that I've used before. Actually, yeah, whatever. I'm 
just wasting a <laughs> lantern fuel, but yeah, why don't I turn off my lantern? Let's be smart. Could still do inventory management in the dark. Oh, I got five of these birch barks now, so that's that's good. But I'm gonna keep keep some of them here. Wow, we, we got lots of sewing kits, so let's stash a couple here. Uh, oh, whetstones too, yeah. We don't even have anything to sharpen yet, so let's make our way out and see if we can't pull off some meat from that deer, because then that would be that'd be a nice free meal for us tomorrow when we can make a fire, hopefully. Right, we might have to do this in little spurts, but let's let's do our best. Fifteen minutes? Ah, we can take that hit. We'll be fine. Let's make our way. Um, let's make our way to the trailer. And what I'm going to do is take the the high ground. So I don't think there's going to be a wolf out right now, but. I am going to go up here because I like this spot. You can have a look on this rock, sort of get a lay of the land, and then you can jump down on this uh, fence here and walk on this fence. And you can shoot wolves from up here, so that's a nice little strategic uh, fence. Let's drop our meat and pop in here. Okay, what time is it? Okay, it's uh, you know, it's not too late. I don't think we can sew or anything, but let's have a look. It might cancel halfway through, but ah, oh, dang, it's a waste of time. What else can we do? Let's craft up some birch bark. Maybe some uh, bandages. It sounds nice now. What if we can get a fire, get that meat cooked up? Yeah, it's a little cold out, but it's not windy. Why not? I got I got energy to burn. Um, I don't think I can break down... Okay, I can break down this, so let's put the fire right here. And then I'll be able to chop up that firewood, maybe, with my hacksaw. I don't know if that's even possible. Maybe I can bust it up by my hands. <laughs> Planks. I think you need a hatchet, though. We'll see. Wait, that didn't work. Come on, little fire. Come on. I thought we had that one for sure. No. Eighty percent. Come on, that should that should do it. Nice, so we got it that time. Okay, let's uh, grab our meat. Raw venison, yum. Oh, oh well. Torch can live there for a second. Uh, okay, let's put some wood on this fire.
need to warm it up a bit more before I can do much. Minus one, zero, plus temperatures. Okay, what's this going to be? Okay, 45 minutes, so I definitely... Uh, that piece might get burnt, but I don't know for sure. Let's, let's put it on standby here and then do this. And then now I got wood. And this can go back and cook without risk of getting burnt. Oh. Alright, there's dinner tonight. Let's eat a bit of that now. Cook up some birch. Yeah, and we're getting tired doing this, so it doesn't Maybe hurt. I could use a drink. Pork and beans. Let's eat this tonight. Why not? Carrying it around forever. level two nice I'll take it okay what time is it <laughs> middle of the night I think I might just pull a few torches off this fire and call it a s sleepy time call it sleepy time oh look at that torch that's that's a good torch I want a few of those I'll probably end up torch walking all the way down to uh, the camp scared. office, so might as well grab a bunch of them. I got I got Tom in the fire, so she's starting to complain about getting heavy, but she can handle it. She's tough. All right, let's uh just make sure we didn't leave anything in here. Like our pot? No. Nope. Okay. We got our bait pieces here. Can put those uh, Man, pieces. Sure I'm carrying much more. Yes, we got. Oh, come on! We got food for the next couple days at least, and that will be like, you know, traveling. We're not gonna dilly dally. We're 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 motoring, motoring through these regions. Uh, let's check our food situation out. Have cattail, maybe. Rest for the night. That will sh that will get us fully rested. We'll wake up early, but it'll be morning, so it's cool. Sun's shining, hopefully. <laughs> oh, not quite morning. Check out our clothing. Ooh, fifty-eight percent. That hurts. Let's repair this. You know what? Actually, um, uh, I don't have a surplus of food. Otherwise, I would, I would really think about reading all my books. <laughs> that would help me. Like the sewing book would help me with the skill up, make me fail less probably. But whatever. We'll do what we can do. Drink some water. Don't wanna, don't wanna get dehydrated sewing. Yeah, these need need work. I don't want to lose these wool socks. Um, they're hard to find, so I'd like to find one more pair actually. These gloves in shape. Ah, uh, never mind. I did leave some. Everything's looking pretty good. It's not terrible, but it could be better. Let's look outside and see see what the situation is. See if we can't get down to a uh, camp office, maybe. We 
going to be extra stinky, but it's okay. Alright, it's not terrible out, so we might as well just make a move. It's a uh, minus two arrow. <laughs> Good enough for me. <clears throat> I got firewood on me still, so I can always have a have a fire and warm up if I need to. Now, sometimes there's a maple down here. I don't think I see it, so I'm not going to stress. I just want to check something. Come on. No. I was just trying to see if it was a Maglen's fire day, but not yet. It's still, still too overcast. You know, we may encounter some wolves on this little journey, but actually that's another thing. Let's check to see what bait drop we, we are doing. So that's one of my bitty pieces, which is good. Sometimes when you are you have like a big piece of meat and then a little piece of meat, you, you of course want to drop the small piece of meat for bait, but it just drops whatever one it wants. So I like to check before I go out and about. All right, we have an opportunity to get some arrows here, or some feathers, sorry for our arrows that are in our future, hopefully. Oh, interesting. Uh, question is now, do we want to have a fire? Cook this guy up here, get the hide. Oh, don't take antibiotics, what are you doing? No, well, I think it's... Why did you go to sleep with... Um, I just didn't didn't do the math right. I thought I, I thought I had more like 800 on me. Ah, uh, let's see. I think I... I think I don't want to get sidetracked too much. Oh. Actually, yeah, let's make a fire. Let's have a fire. Let's have a... Dirty quick fire here. <laughs> Boom, 100%. Now, GTFO, wolf. Get out of here. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Okay. Yeah. Get, get out of here. Yeah, okay, now they're scared off. So, we're not warming up yet. Let's put... Another wood on here. Let's see what we're doing. Minus three, minus two, minus one. Oh, those wolves are close. <laughs> I'm safe here though. Okay, I need more wood. Okay, that should be it. So let's pull this off. We're warming up. We're getting meat. We'll get a hide. Maybe even guts. We'll see. Yeah, monkey man, I uh I'm like doing the starvation game, but I'm also like I don't like bleeding condition if I if I have a lot of lot of food. So every once in a while, I'll just I'll have a bite to eat, <laughs> and then uh, and then my character's health isn't depleting too quick. Okay, let's see what we can do here. It's an hour, so let's just pull off a gut and then get our meat finished, and then we can we can think about the hide. We're gonna be so stinky though. It's kind of a bad bad move, but whatever. We might lose our fire here shortly. Let's get some water. Yeah, the wind's coming up. Uh oh. You know what? I think uh, I'm a little nervous here now. Because that wolf is just hanging out. Let's scare that wolf off before our fire blows out. Okay. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> but... Um, yeah, yikes. Let's get out of here. I can't can't mess around with that hide. If you never ne if you never needed to eat except at night, you lose very little not eating. Yeah, that makes sense cuz that's the starvation game you play. Oh, okay, run away. Where's that other wolf? Um yeah, so you you lose a little bit of condition. Oh, come on. Is that fire still lit? Mom.
All right, come get me. Maybe I can still keep this torch going here. Nope. Uh, this is like kind of dicey here, guys. Okay, they're both running now. Let's go left. No way. I'm going into this thing here because there could be loot. <laughs> Monkey man, you and your logic. <laughs> I, I actually, I would have, I would have done that, but. Okay, let's go. 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 All right, you can have a treat. I will give you a piece of meat. Enjoy. You can have that gut, and then we're gonna go. We are gonna move with haste because it is minus three triangles. Yeah, stopping to get that deer is one of those those things where Damn. probably should have just kept on, kept on keeping on. Because I got some meat, but I didn't get the hide, and and the hide is what I really wanted. So let's keep keep boogieing here. I think we're putting enough distance between us and that wolf. There's two of them, so they're they're doing their own thing. But uh <laughs> I'm a little paranoid of wolves. And I don't really know how they work. <laughs> so I better state than sorry. feathers quickly quickly no yeah I'm not gonna mess around with this uh, this situation here let's go we're almost at mystery lake camp office yeah we're gonna pop in there see if we can find our bedroll and then uh, that will probably be it for the night for me for streaming but like I said I'll be on bright and early tomorrow morning and I'm gonna carry on with this character and see if we can't get our forge run done Get to the forge, get craft in our gear. It'll be nice. I don't want to get ahead of myself, but that's the plan. We could get a Maglens fire right now if it wasn't so windy, but it's definitely way too windy for a fire, so. I'm happy I have my flare gun. It's a nice little last line of defense quickly. Excuse me. Yeah, sometimes there's wolves right around the camp office and leading up to it and on the lake, so I'm just going to go go quickly and quietly, hopefully. Okay, I don't see anything. Yeah, let's run. Home sweet home. Camp office. Nice. So let's loot this quickly. Let's see what we got in store for us. Drop our meat out here, how about? Good. We got a good pile of meat, a couple of kilograms of meat, so that will <sighs> that will keep us going until we're <laughs> until we find more food. Hopefully, I have lots of cattails, so I'm just trying to think about like how quickly I need to work out of here if I have uh, forage in my future. I will pre keep playing your game, your style. I appreciate that, my hire. Um, yeah, my game, my style is like new beginner deluxe here on Interloper, but I'm having fun and uh, I'm trying to be like a little smarter, like, because I, I know I definitely got in the habit of, of sitting in a, in a region for way too long. So the idea of this, this game specifically is to, to boogie a bit faster during the first 40 days. Def improving. Thank you, Colin. Appreciate it. Yeah. Yeah. I got my cheerleading squad with me here, so things are good. You're doing so well. Mm, you are probably funny. you are problem solving well. Thank you. Yeah, I, I like to to think I'm capable, but every now and then I get really flustered and stressed out. You know, when there's so much going on and it's like critical level. When it's simple stuff, I'm okay, but <laughs> we'll see. Hopefully, I just improve and it gets easier as I go.
What do we got in here? Oh, another pot. I'm just going to put this uh, here because I have two pots right now. And we learned last time you can craft at night at this table if you start a fire here, which is a cool tip. So I didn't know that. So that's a good way to craft at night. Oh, can opener. We have one of those. So look at all this surplus of loot. We've already found two hacksaws. We've got all the good stuff, all the good loot. What's that? A tin of sardines. I think I can use this. Ninety-six percent sardines. Wow. I'm gonna eat that because it's not gonna kill me. <laughs> Seventy percent and under though. Don't don't mess with that. Okay, let's see what we got upstairs. Moment of truth. Corpse, corpse friend here. She is our bedroll. Whoa! 18%? Oh man. <laughs> Good thing I was hustling. Gee whiz. Let's repair that thing like ASAP. That's gonna take some some crafting. Wow. It's in rough shape. I'm getting weak. <laughs> glad I glad I didn't wait any longer. <laughs> Let's do a whole nother round of repairs on it. We want it in nice condition. 78. It's good enough for now. Wow. Look, another pot. We've got four pots now. It's crazy. You know that guy who drank his own pee doesn't seem so crazy right about now. Okay, what else we got in here? That was exciting. <laughs> this is like the fourth pair of mittens I found. It's like Mitten City here. Okay. Wow, it sounds lovely outside. So I think I think what I'm gonna do is drink some water, go outside, get a save point, and call it call it here. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm not able to host or, or raid a channel. Otherwise, I would I would send everyone along to someone else to enjoy. But uh, you're gonna have to fend for yourselves until I until I get my uh, OSB set up and stream elements and all that. But so far, I'm, I'm having fun. I'm glad everyone could join me. <laughs> Don't worry. Look how nice it is. Oh my goodness. Look at this. It's zero degrees out. Zero degrees. Sun is shining. Okay. Let's get our save point. It can't get better than this. <laughs> yeah, we have something nice, nice in the morning to look forward to. A nice, clear, sunny day to do some more traveling. But again, thank you everyone for stopping by. My hire, Colin, Monkey Man, all you guys, you've been awesome helping me out. Um, Sidearm TV, thank you for stopping by today. Appreciate you. And um, hopefully, hopefully we see you tomorrow. I'm I'm planning on getting up early and getting right back into it. So enjoy the rest of your your evenings, everyone. And uh, thanks again, stopping by. The Wands is out.